No. I'm not going to Maria's play. Yes, I know she's your best friend's daughter. Why? I'll tell you why. There's something off about her. I can't put my finger on it, but there's something. No, it's not because she made fun of my poem, Edith. Which we both know is great, by the way. Why would you think that? Listen, Mom. Just get the car and pick me the fuck up. Appreciates my genius. Come on, man, I'm a human being. Sure, you might be a human being if you drop some pounds, fat ass. <laughs> Chill. Chill, it was just a joke, it was just a joke. Drive now! Drive! Man, why the hell are you here? Why are you chasing that random guy, fool? Does it matter? I was just sitting there. It's literally my bench. First thing you say to your old pal Lippy, what's a bench between friends? Horrible. Horrible what things are coming to. Only horrible thing coming to is having to see your ugly ass every day. Yeah, at least I'm not the one covered in coffee. Are you serious? You're telling me you just watched me get assaulted and thought, oh, let me take a nice seat on this little bench. Hey, look, Turin, listen. A man's got to rest. You're a clown, bro. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, look, man. No hard feelings. Listen, man, you trying to get some meat. So, turn. What are you going to do? You going to bark all night, little doggy? Or are you going to bite? Mm -hmm. I mean, I guess I'll keep living. He did get away. Listen, with any luck, he'll get what's coming to him. Hey, a real man makes his own luck. If that happened to me, that fool wouldn't be walking. Well, unlike you, I ain't no psychopath. I never put nobody in the hospital. Technically, I didn't do that. Then who did? The car did. Technically, sure. It wouldn't have to if no this one It's always him bark, the... bark, bark, yap, yap, yap with you. You need an awakening. Wake up and bite, Turin. God, talk about disturbing the peace. You wanna see disturbing the peace? I'm just warming up. Where are you going, clown?
That's my bite.